going on? <clears throat> Just a quick update in reference to my um, my Roadmaster uh, training. Um, everything's going good. I got to say, it's still going good. There's just a few things I want to address. Um, you know, let me say this real quick. Um, I know a lot of people online like myself, you know, we started following people like Mr. Sinister, um, um, The Right Brother, um, Trucker Named Jay, uh, Lushan. You know, we started following all these different truckers who are out there doing it. And I got to say the information they provided, it's it, it it's been great you know i gotta say you know it's been great you know from seeing from seeing who give inspirational videos and push people to do things which is cool um the right brother who's been just keeping it straight and keeping it real um so back on topic um my training training is good um let me say this um like i said before those guys are giving good information but you gotta do it i'm sorry you just gotta get out and do it you know, it took it took years for me to move. You know, I followed it, I looked at it, I thought about it, I, 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 I you know, and then I just said, you know what, I want it, you know, and um, I, I, I want it. So I was looking at um, Steve Harvey one day, and he had a guest on the show, and the and the guest said, "It's not you're not going to do anything about it until it becomes important to you," um, which makes sense you know it's, it's, it makes sense until it becomes important enough for you you ain't gonna move okay it became important to me so i started moving um, um so you know me being at role master is good i've learned a lot so far understand folks i work um so i decided to go on the weekend go to the weekend classes and it's working for me i gotta say it's working for me Money wise, I decided to um, to take a different approach instead of taking out a loan uh, to get the funding for um, six thousand nine hundred ninety five dollars. I wasn't taking that route, um, so I took another route, and it works for me, which I'll share with you guys sometime later, maybe in the next video. Um, but for the most part, you know, there's stuff that I'm I'm learning, man. That's great. Like um, like right now, I just reached out to DMV. And I wanted to look at my H6 report. I wanted to get a copy of my H6 report to see if I need to submit a um, an amendment, um, an H6 amendment, if if I had any traffic violation or any, anything like that on my traffic on my um, on my DMV records. Reason being is I didn't know that if you get your license and then all of a sudden you go and start working or driving for a carrier, and they run records on you or they check your driving record. Um, what's going to happen is, or let me say, say, let me change it. What happens is when you get your, 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 um, your, uh, your class A, all your history of driving, any past, any records, any crash, and it, it follows on over to your class A. So if there's stuff on there that's old and you need it amended, then you need to contact DMV and request to have it amended or request to have it removed before it gets onto your, um, onto your uh, your class a you know it's so much it's a lot you know there's things that carries weight in reference to your csa um your csa scores you know your ratings etc is what i'm learning um and, and you know i gotta say it's it's, it's, it's a lot um, but you're not gonna learn it until you step out there and you hit that class you know um and if i'm saying it wrong if i'm wording it wrong i'll go back and correct it later but for the most part you know i'm going to class and right now, um, I can access um, um, eTread, which is one of the training uh, sites that um, Roadmaster provides to us during training. I can access, access it from my house, so I can actually do training and stuff from home. You know, I'm doing my um, my training through um, um, Christ, CR, or Chris CRSTCDL.com website. I'm out there answering the questions, and um, and I've been out there for months now. So some of the questions that I already studied are on the study material that I have from Roadmaster. So thumbs up on that. Thumbs up to um, to Sinister, Mr. Sinister, who gave out that information on one of his websites. So thank you, bro. It works. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely glad I got it. It works. So um, the third week. 
um, which is the week end of June 4th, I think, is the week that we're going to be taking it to the blacktop, to the tarmac, to start getting into the trucks and learning to drive. Um, I can't wait for that. So right now I'm just doing all my studying, um, making sure when I go take my tests um, next week or the week after next, I'll be ready to pass. Um, I don't want to be one of those guys that keeps going back over and over and over and over again. Understand, it's a $73 charge here in California for us to go and take that test. Secondly, um, guys in the class kept asking, well, they ask, one, do you already have your um, your permit? If you already have your permit, then you're basically going to sit back a little bit, start working on E-Tread um, until the rest of your class get caught up. Um, because you already have your permit. Not to mention, I think they waiver the fee. I think they waiver an amount from your from your class your class amount. So um, so you can go and get your permit if you choose to study. Um, what was it? Uh, Air brakes, combination, and knowledge and skills. So if you go and study all that and you pass, then you're good. That's that's fine. Just know that you're going to be waiting in class until everybody else get, gets their um, gets their permit. Okay. Um, secondly, um, we did our uh, your analysis um, in physical last weekend. Um, everything was fine. Um, you know, it, it's a regular res, regular physical. You know, go in there. You know, give your sample. Um, be able to see. Be able to hear. If you need glasses, bring them with you. If you need your hearing aid, bring it with you. Um, don't skip on it. You know, have your ID. You know, have everything you need. You know, don't play. You know, take it serious. Um, go there ready to roll. Um, I'm going to tell you right now, if you don't have it, they're starting to look at you as the weak, the one who's not prepared. So come on board, be prepared, be ready to go. Um, and I got to say, you know, it's, 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 you know, if you take that route, you do the small steps, man, it, 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 uh, it, it puts you in a whole nother bracket. Um, so my next step now is to to get my permit um, get out there on that tarmac and start learning how this truck works um, take everything that I've learned with the with all the um, with all the test questions study questions and apply it to inside that cab so um, I'm, I'm sorry it's just me I take it serious I take what I do serious um, when like I told my instructor um, I'm making almost like a career change so from one profession to another I take it serious um, I have fun, but first I got I got to know my craft. I got to know my craft first before I can have fun. So um, that's a lot of that's a lot of um, truck out there to be messing around with. So I want to know everything I need to know about it to make it safe for myself and other and other drivers around me or the four wheelers, which is what a lot of drivers say. The four wheelers out there who don't pay attention or take heed in that big truck that's by them. So um, not a, not a long video. I just want to keep giving a little quick updates so that so that people uh, will understand how things are going. You know, don't you know? It's it's good to listen to everybody else and what they're doing, but you know, you got to get out there and do it. You know, there are a lot of good drivers out there, and they give great videos and good information, and it pushes pushes people, which is good. But man, you just got to go and do it. I mean, you got to do it. And I'm, I'm gonna give shouts out to um to the little guy, uh, little guy truck. You know, his videos. He's been giving videos out there now where he's been um, being a trainer. I've seen some of what he's doing um, for night. And he's with this one guy where he's, you know, he's showing them how to alley dock and the back straight and, you know, drive throughs and stuff like that. Those videos, man, those videos are good. Those are good videos. Keep them, keep it up. Keep them coming. I like those videos. Um, so anyway, I got to get back to some studying. And uh, in, uh, Saturday morning, 7 o'clock. Right and early, I'll be back in class again, and uh, I'll be there Sunday as well, and uh, another week of studying, and then I think that Thursday or that Friday, I'm going to be testing for my um, for my permit. Wish me luck, and uh, I'll see you guys out there on the road. All right, take care. Bye.